In this episode, we will be exploring an abandoned castle in Scotland named Lennox Castle. Lennox Castle is located in Lennox Town, Scotland. It is known for once being Scotland's largest institution for people with learning disabilities. The castle was built between 1837 and 1841. In 1927, the castle and its land was purchased by the Glasgow Corporation and was converted into the mental hospital. The hospital opened its doors in 1936. The castle itself was the nurse's home and its grounds provided accommodation for about 1,200 patients. Soon after opening, the facilities were vastly overcrowded, understaffed, and underfunded. By 1982, 1,360 patients between the ages of 10 and 80 years old were looked after by around 500 staff, with fewer than half of these being trained nurses. The care provided by the hospital was reported to be poor, with patients being malnourished. This hospital was shut down permanently in 2002. In 2008, there was a devastating fire that left the castle in ruins. I think we made it. Wow. And there's like a tower thing right here that like collapsed and you can see like the hole of the window. That's cool. There's a little stairway over here. When we explored this castle, we had no idea about its historical significance as well as the conditions patients were exposed to in this Ooh. hospital. All the way on the top of the mountains. An old castle. Wow. Look at that. It's pretty crazy. That is amazing. Like, of course, there'll be graffiti on it. I don't know how people would even get up here just to do that. That's, that's kind of strange. If only you knew how much we've walked to get up here. <laughs> I guess let's do like a, let's like walk around the property yeah. first. And then I saw that there was a hole in the fence and then we'll go up and close. That's cool. This is definitely not a normal site for us. <laughs> no, not at all. So I guess it kind of, it ends here and keeps going, but this is the castle. So yep. what we need to do in order to get to the back and all these other areas, I think we need to walk back to where we just were in the beginning and get to that hole Yeah. and get inside. So let's do that. Let's, let's go that way. I can't believe they'll let something this historic get into, you know, in this shape. And as you guys can see, I just want to prove this. Permanently closed. This is not a tourist attraction castle, like many of them, which are still amazing and beautiful. But this one seemed special to us when we were driving up here, picking what we wanted to go see. The fact that this is just hidden away in the mountain is not something that every tourist just rolls up and goes to. Yep. That's what's special. So. That's cool. It's Scotland's largest institution for people with learning disabilities. Wow. 
back then. So let's hop in. Wow, look at the the detail. That's crazy. Oh my god. Now, obviously here's the signs of people hanging out here. They're yeah. making fires and stuff like that. These are things you don't do at abandoned places like this, especially I mean, this historic. To no me, respect. It's, it's weird because growing up with Kings Park Psych Center, like, end up being trash. Like, it makes sense. But a freaking castle? Why trash that? Let's go in this door. Wow. It's pretty slippery. Gotta watch our step. We're going to need a light. Yeah. Hold this. We're going to pause for a second. And get that out. We'll be back in two seconds. Okay, we got the light on. Okay. Wow. What is this? Oh, this is scary. What are all these cubbies? I don't know. Wow, like in a cave den up there, like really bad. I think it ends. Yeah, looks like it. This whole thing is just crumbled. I wonder what all this is for. I see like weird pieces of wood. Yeah, that one looks like it's caught on fire. Yeah, I can I can't tell like what in here is old and what's new because so many people like Oh look at those spiders. Oh my god. They're Yo. huge. <laughs> oh my god. Oh look he's crawling right towards us. Arachnophobia just kicked in. Holy crap. Oh Okay, there's probably a bunch above us and stuff. Oh, yeah, man. look at their wet, um, their eggs. Oh. Oh, there you go. Oh, oh my there you go. God. And Yo. they're definitely above us. Holy crud. <laughs> Bro. They're huge. That one is like, oh, that's scary. Oh, there's one on the wall up there, too. Oh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, we're done with that part. Oh, man. Kind of want like a piece of this place, like a, a little broken. A yeah, rock. Yeah. Even all those bricks. Wild. This is insane. I can't believe this is standing. We have to turn back around. Found a little coin here and don't know if it has anything to do with anything, but. I think it's just a random coin someone dropped. 10 pence, yeah, it's an English. Well, they used um, pounds out here. So it's accurate to here. Is there yeah. a date on it? I don't think they date it, really. Yeah, 2011. Yeah, let me find a rock. That looks like somebody wiped their behind with that, so. Yeah. Not around there. Um, probably one of these, like there. 
they're obviously like broken from this thing. Yeah. I'll find one outside. <laughs> we'll walk the whole thing. Yeah. It's not like we're taking an object, we're taking a literal rock. Yeah. So. Okay, and we're back outside. Oh, this place is muddy. Here, hold this. Wow. Tell me. Look at that. So tall. It went up three floors. And all of it's collapsed. And those are like closets. I guess. Oh man. This piece is loose. Yeah. It made me like spin the camera too fast. Wow. This was definitely um the um, outline of that window. Yeah. Or one of those above us. That's crazy, right? Mm -hmm. Hopefully we don't fall into some ditch. I don't want to get into one of those closets. <laughs> yeah. Should we go this way? Yeah, I guess so. It's like the other side of where we were before. Yeah. Just watch okay. for nails. Is the light still on? Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> really steep. Wow. Look. Hmm. 12, 6, 7, 12, 6, 8 steam valves. Wow. Look. There was some sort of mug here. Somebody put all the pieces right here. Wow, and that must have been like yeah, beautiful. Maybe we could find something still intact, but I don't know. I'll keep my eyes peeled on the floor. Yeah. Right there, there's some more writings. 1271. And this goes to nothing. <laughs> probably because it was a steam like yeah. um, pipe room. The pipe probably went underneath this hole here. Yeah. What are these things? Some old bolts. And getting in there. That's what I was just thinking. They put like wood there so that somebody could step up. 
I don't know if I'm tall enough to do it though. Yeah, me either. And it's slippery, it's wet, so. We could try to get through that one, that little hole on the left. Okay. Yeah. Okay, hopefully none of this falls on us. Wow, there's a, wow. There's a staircase here. Oh, wow. Okay. Which way should we go first? I'm starting to see the signs of graffiti. Yeah. I'm gonna say this direction. This must be a door. Sure was. Oh, wow. This goes all the way up, look at that. <laughs> like through the hole, can you see it? Yep. Wow. Oh. Slipping. This is crazy. Now where do we go first? I do not know. That was like an elevator shaft for sure. And you can see it here. There's a tire swing in here. For real? I swear to God. Oh man. <laughs> oh my I'm God. I climb this with one hand. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Wow. We're in the middle of it. <laughs> I don't know how to do this. Oh man, that's cool. How would they even tie that up there? You see that? Hell no. Oh my God, look how it ends. Yeah, who would swing on that too? You're a psycho. I'm pretty scared being right here. <clears throat> oh man, this is dangerous. Whew. Okay. We're on the top of something. That's the front door that we were at before. Wow. I'm pretty sure. This is insane. Oh man. It's windy. Yeah. That's crazy, that tire swing. Standing on all that rubble. I know, right? <laughs> you wanna swing over that stuff and it's held on by that thing? Yeah, no. <laughs> That's just playing with your life right there. Yeah. Wow. Man. The way it's overgrown is just so pretty. Yeah. I guess we have to go the way we came in order well, to... Well, before that, let's... We're going to pause real quick, take our pictures so we don't have to go through this again. Because this is pretty dangerous. So, yeah, we're going to take our pictures and then we'll show you guys the rest of it.
This is crazy. Wow. It just rained a little bit. So, hopefully we don't slip. Okay, we're going this way. Just gotta be careful. It looks like in some parts your foot can like fall through. Like this one rock that's loose. Oh, oh man. Okay. I don't know where to step. Whew. Wow. Very hard to get footing. And it constantly keeps raining because we're on the top of the mountain. Angle looks cool outside. Uh. Okay. You see all those support beams and those pipes and stuff like yeah. that. The sounds of the airplanes is freaking me out. It's so loud. Crazy how much plants have grown. Hopefully online we find some pictures of how this place once looked, especially the inside. I would love to see that. Yeah, that would be great. Yeah. Whew. Wow. No. It's starting to rain again. This, is, this is obviously the middle part, but over here, we I know we can get into that had like the stairs that you're seeing connected to those that the tire swing is hanging from. So I think that's our next step is to go into that area and yeah. then go into these little corridors that are hidden like we started with and see if there's anything on the floors or left behind or whatever. Yep. But what a beautiful middle part of this castle. Okay, we made it down on this side. Just take a look at that stuff. That's crazy. That's so cool. It's beautiful. You could have seen the stairs would have gone up yeah. this way into the castle. Oh, that's cool. Window. Yeah, let's go peek through this window. Wow. This is cool. Of course, this person had the graffiti right here. That sucks, but overall, the castle itself is lovely. Look at the door in here from the elevator. Let me get down here. It's still hanging. 
That's crazy. That staircase is cool too. Yeah. Whew. I don't know if we can go up that. Yeah, I don't know. There's holes in the floor. The staircase is like leaning right there like it's about to break. Middle of Scotland, so I don't know how fast 911 comes out here. <laughs> you probably won't get through. So we're trying to avoid getting hurt. Like, look at this. Mm. Sketchy, sketchy, sketchy. I'm not going to go far because of that, but And <sighs> if we're cutting the camera a lot, that's because we're taking slow steps through all of this. We can't, we have to have both hands accessible at all times. We don't want to die. Okay. Wow. That looks cool. Yeah. This side. Yeah. I don't know if we're going to go up any more yeah, floors. Look how thin the stairs are, too. Yeah. And. It would just bring us to the top, which would be a cool view, but we're going to get that by drone. Yeah. Not by human walking up there. Wow. Yeah, let's take some pictures again. We're going to cut it, and we'll catch you guys at the next area we're getting. Okay, we're back down. Now, we're going to check out one of these sections. Probably this one, because that one leads outside. So. This is a cool piece. What? It's like, like the bars of a stair. Oh, that's cool. Okay, we're going down here next. Oh, look at the tile on the wall. Yeah. Ugh, this is dangerous. Well, this is everyone's graffiti spot. Yeah. It's too tall for this. <laughs> okay, I got this. Oh man, stuff is just falling off the walls. You saw that? Yeah. That's dangerous. Random pile of things. Would have been pretty all the tile if they didn't graffiti over it. Yeah, I wonder what this wall would have, I said wall, room, would have been. There's a big piece of mirror right there. Maybe it was like a bathroom? Yeah, that's possible. Like a huge one. There's this weird shaped stone. I don't know what that would have been for. Any random things people leaving behind? Same thing in here. Graffiti land. Who would even think of graffitiing on this stuff? It's 
Should we go around here first before we go in the center? Yeah, probably straight. Now this kind of is like a dead end. It's just this room and this. shaved wall. Yeah, let me take a look in this one. Okay. Yeah, this is cool. The shape of this. This is the center area of the castle, I guess. It's beautiful. You can hear those loud crows. Yeah. It's just overgrown with trees and... You know, it's funny. Like I've always said, Europe has some of the coolest graffiti. We haven't seen any of it though. <laughs> it all looks like the normal graffiti you see where yeah, we're like, from. Look, it's just... It's just the same. We're always seeing pictures of people like, cool graffiti. Um, Murals. Yeah, murals. But this is not it. Wow. That must have been a piece of like, you can see the, the, opening, the, yeah. the red wood up there on the top. Wow. Oh. And this would have opened into a, a big entryway into the middle. Probably where they would come in with their horses and stuff. Yeah. Where should we go, this way? Uh, yeah, I guess so. People created a bench. It's definitely a hangout spot for the locals. It's kind of weird though, because there's nothing around here. No. This is cool though, the stairwell. Careful of this hole. I don't know where it goes. Look wow. at this. And it goes all the way up. So somebody whoever, climbed that. Yeah, somebody climbed this to tie up that swing. That's scary. Yeah. Whoa. Be careful. There's a lot of glass. Wow. Is that bob wire? That is bob wire. Oh, that's cool. It's a part of something. I wonder what it went to. Maybe like the, well, it's not as thick. I was gonna say, is it that great? Uh, in the stairwell? It? Yeah, it is. Yeah. This is all bob wire. Now why would they like, like, I get they don't want people climbing it, but it's really not a good idea because people are going to do it anyway. Yeah. So you'd rather slice them up as they're like that high off the ground. I don't There's no hospitals around or There's anything. There's no signs saying not to do it, so they just put barbed wire. Exactly. A lot of it, too. Look at it. It's all on the floor. I didn't even see this the first time we came through here. I thought it was vines. It did look like vines because it's also got like a green yeah. tinge. That's dangerous. So this is kind of like the inside of that entryway that we saw before. I'm standing on like a window. And there's a, a door, here. door It's actually pretty cool how it goes up like that. Everything was red. You can tell the paint was yeah. once red. Right here. This is cool. Definitely a bathroom, because look. It's the top of a toilet? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Wow. 
window frames still exist. That's really cool. You know, even though this place is a ruin, I think it's really special. Because for it to be from the 1800s and go through so much weathering and decay and it still has some elements of its beauty left behind, it's still so fascinating to me. Yep. And the history that we're going to figure out, I bet it's going to be awesome. I don't know what's in here, but it looks like a light. Like... Yeah. That's cool. And I know we're saying that's cool a lot, but you gotta think of it. You gotta think of it this way, and in our shoes. This is the first time we've ever explored an abandoned castle. So we're very fascinated by everything. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, look how big that spider oh. is. I cannot. Look how many mosquitoes are on the wall too. That oh, thing is freaking massive. Let's keep it. Oh my God, no. That thing's probably poisonous. Maybe. I don't know if they got, you know, they probably do every place. Look at all these mosquitoes. <sighs> They're just flying all over. I have West Nile leaving here. But like, I, I don't know if they have poisonous spiders or whatever. And we're surrounded by them. What? Yeah. It's a cool like archway above us. Wow. Let's go back to that main area. Yeah, I know we have a lot of um, viewers from the UK and a lot of you know that like this is our first time here in the UK. Um, but there's something about these countries that are special because they have so much history that's different to ours. You know, there America was only found at yep. a certain point in time. You know, these countries go way farther back than our country ever will. Um, Lots of history. So, you know, we usually don't explore ruins, but if something has this much history in it, I think it's just as cool as every other place we explore. Go check out like this side of the the courtyard. That's the outside of where we were. Whew. An old like tub of something. Yeah. This used to go so high. Maybe we can get in that area. I don't know if we mentioned this already, but that loudness, there's definitely an airport nearby. Yeah. So I guess we gotta go this way. Okay, let's see what we can find on this side. Some weird like. Maybe they had like a little stuff? garden here. 
Yeah. I don't know. It's starting to rain again. Mm. Oh. You can see oh, the yeah. uh, window frame right there. And at the door. Skeleton oh. keyhole. And a Yale lock mechanism. Imagine we found a skeleton key. I would I would probably die of happiness, but you know, likelihood of that is Probably gonna be pretty slim because they'll probably be under all of this. Some outlets. That's funny. Now, it's kind of annoying to go through this, so let's go around and restart. Oh, yeah, look, the berries. They look like blackberries, but they're, I don't know if they are because they're tiny. Yeah, like, look. Oh, yeah. Is that a real blackberry? Maybe. I think it is. Let's take a picture of it. it. Smells like it. It does? Yeah, I can smell it. I'm not going to test that out and eat it. Um, I don't know, maybe. Because you can die. <laughs> Not a good idea. Right. You want to that? Yeah. Oh man, I'm just so exhausted from like the way we're stepping. What is these things? It's like train tickets, unrelated. Okay. Yeah. This is pretty tight, like you said. Maybe you could just put the camera in there and like take a look around. You can see a door up there with the skeleton, two skeleton holes, oh, keyholes. Wow. Is it easy to get around? Oh man. This door has it right here. Yeah, this is slippery too. Whew. Oh man. A few moments later. As you just saw, I fell face first. I didn't hit my face, but it went straight down. But I didn't like cut myself, which is kind of like the biggest thing I was worried about because like I'm kind of expired on my tetanus shot. I think I'm like 11 or 12 years ago and it's in the every 10. Of nowhere. Yeah, and we're in Scotland. So I still want to see that <laughs> skeleton keyhole. <laughs> you don't learn, huh? It's the wood. It's slippery. It's way more slippery than the stone. So like, I mean, good thing that didn't happen when we were in the middle of the damn thing. Yeah. But uh, we're going to have Zach slowly go up to it and then I'm going to hand him the camera instead of face first planting into the, luckily like we have a hood, you know, and like it hit like directly onto the edges of this. So it didn't scratch his lens and it hit the handle. So, and it took it, it I guess because the force was straight on and not on an angle. It didn't mess up his um, zoom or anything like that. But if it starts acting up and being funky, we get back to the US, we'll buy a second lens and just have that one fixed and have like a backup one. Because I guess things are gonna happen when you're crawling around in the ruins and abandoned buildings, but I haven't fell in a bandle in a minute, but our vandals are not wet and literally dangerous. This is really, dangerous. This is bad. Yeah. So, good, this is still on me. I didn't even know if my mic still was on me. So we're gonna try this again. Cause that was annoying. I really want. What is the view through that window? Is it closer? Maybe. Uh, oh my god! <laughs> 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 You're not learning, huh? 
I couldn't see helmets. it because the this. <laughs> I couldn't see anything above. Yo. I think we need helmets. I need yeah. a bike helmet. <laughs> I'm need... so slow. <laughs> I could see the door you wanted to look at. Oh it's right God. here. Oh my God. Okay. <sighs> Let's try this again. Bend and walk. Oh my God. Now this is the door she was trying to get to. Yeah, because there's like a door to the outside right here. I can see. Okay. So like, that's oh. what people are probably walking through to get into this area. I guess we took the we took rough the, route. Yeah, we took the rough route. So, exit. So should we hop over this? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm not going to be doing any climbing with any more cameras. And as you know, these are pretty <laughs> expensive cameras oh, and thousands. lens. This lens itself, how much is your lens? The whole setup is five grand. Five grand. Well, the, this, oh, together. This, it's, the body is over three grand. Yeah. It's almost four grand. So it's probably more, it's more like six grand because this is a two grand lens. Yeah. yeah. And then my camera is about two grand and the lens is about 1,300 yeah, or less. something. It's just slightly By less hundreds, than this like one. Yeah. 300 less, 400 less. And this one's actually, this one's more, this body is more so for photography. His camera is more so for the video making. Yeah. So they're both, fantastic cameras but just some have some ups than the others um but sony sony sony's freaking great no matter what you get yeah look what we just went um, through and it's i just still smashed that thing yeah. into a piece of wood and it's still good we'll see how long it lasts but it I should think be good. good it's I not think bended be or fine. anything i remember my last it's um, not doing any i felt my last lens probably was, on an angle remember it was too. like i went like directly like yeah it looks straight like no. that I don't see any scratches. If not, we'll be buying another lens. That's fine. So we'll Let's see. get through this but, window. Yeah, if any of you guys are trying to get into photography <laughs> or videography, go Sony. But you can always start off with your with phone. With anything. iPhones but, are advanced. You know, if you want to invest yeah. in your your hobby or your trade, Sony, in my opinion, I know a lot of people are going to say yeah. Canon. No, Nikon, Sony is the best, especially while filming. Sony, I've started from the beginning 10 years ago with Sony and I've gotten and upgraded over time. And I had Nikon, Canon, had, and yeah. then Sony. And then but you Sony like is the, the best, best right? yeah. yeah. Sony for the win. They're, They're very hardy. Durable, hardy. Yeah. I mean, the you know, people who film movies, most of them are Sony. Yeah, this camera right here has 66 megapixels. It's ridiculously clear. Okay. Whew. I have, haven't slipped yet, but it's coming. I don't have good grip. She has good grip on those shoes and she slips. So imagine me with yeah. these dunks. Well, dunks are not made for- Well, $200 dunks. <laughs> They're not meant for hiking. People are probably like, why are you exploring in these shoes? I have a history of exploring in some crazy shoes. So, yeah. Skechers. <laughs> You know, sketch your life. They're destroyed now. Look at them. Yeah. Blech. At the hotel, I'm gonna have to scrub yeah, these things. Yeah, mine too. But I kind of like. I liked how they looked, but we got them for the trip, so like, I knew they'd probably end up being destroyed anyway. But me, on the other hand, I don't really have any. Well, I did buy shoes just for exploring, but I left them. Yeah. But look at this little thing. What is this? Some sort of switch. Yeah, probably a light switch. An old one. Because it would have been right here, the, the light fixture. The movement's okay though, it doesn't seem jittery, right? Nope. It's good? Okay. As of now, I don't notice anything. Okay. Um, <laughs> you see from this side. There you <laughs> go. I didn't even have to go through all that. She wanted to see these little skeleton things. And this is a, a nice little hallway, the first thing I'm looking at. Some sort of glass. Look at the texture in the glass. Wow. People are probably saying, don't pick up shards of glass. There's like these little like, almost like mini closets. I don't really know. Yeah, it's little room. They're like tiny rooms, yeah. Imagine these were like cells or something. Yeah, imagine. 
Yeah, and this is the other room. Okay. Cool. I think. I think that's it. It just goes to like the outside. Yeah. So I think we can go out that door. Yeah. And see where we're at. Hold up. Holding. We can go out through this little window if you can fit. Or would you rather the door? <laughs> um, that is quite skinny. Yeah. I mean, I can make it, but. Trying to say I'm fat? You don't no, think I can I'm make saying it? I can make it, but like I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to have to squeeze right now. Yeah. My finger feels weird. I put all my damn weight on it. And we're out. Wow. Okay. Wow. Look at those. The. It's like faces. Oh wow. That is awesome. <laughs> That's beautiful. Yeah. Well, I guess we want to take some exterior pictures now. What do you think? I guess so. All right, guys, so we're all done exploring that abandoned Scottish castle. We thought it was amazing. Yeah. We loved the history of it, minus me almost falling on my face, but it was totally worth the explore. Make sure to subscribe and like if you haven't already, and check us out on our social media platforms on Facebook, Urbex Vibes, Instagram, Urbex Vibes, Oxidize93, and RealZek, and on TikTok, yep. RealZek and Oxidize93, and we'll see you for the next explore.